Welcome back, one and all, to the viewer game day. Well, that does sound frustrating, Wolf. Oh yeah, the Colosseum battles are absolute, like, nonsense garbage in those games, even though the, the <laughs> combat is so fun. I finally caught Alex's hold. Woo! Woo! So if far, you know it's I mean. not as bad as it could be. Welcome to Cahoots. We are going to be playing Goofy Cahoots. Some of them are like bad fan fiction. You know, like they're 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 written poorly. Some of them are just fine. They're just about a silly topic. I think my favorite one though is the one that we did about fire alarms. Oh, that's right. They yeah. have they have the two step join, but you can't use it on stream because it requires you to see the screen in real time. Mm -hmm. It's so dumb. Why not just make it like a captcha or something? Yeah. No, it's fine. I don't care. Just leave it on the oh, most. Show questions and answers on oh, players' yeah, that devices. On. That seems really good. Yep. There's none. Gosh darn. Okay. Kirby. Yeah, it's time for a Kirby quiz. Kirby quiz. Hello, Sordior. You gonna play some Kirby music in the background? Maybe. I was thinking about it. Hey, guess what? What? I'm Wise Shark. Nice. Wow. You you got an advantage then. I'm the Shrek. S S S rank slay. I'm going to do. Okay, let's do this one. The penguin. I think it's so funny that the the um, glasses with the year on it are still a thing, even though they only made sense for two thousand through two thousand nine. Yeah, they only made sense in the two thousands. In the aughts. And I want to be clear: I don't think they should stop making them. I think they're hilarious. Well, maybe they should stop making them into their cheap plastic that gets thrown away. So just make them out of like uh, reusable stuff or decomposable stuff. A concept, cute, but they're made of a little bit less cute. They got charming eagle. Wait, why is that one? Damn it! That that sounds good. Yeah. Oh my gosh, I never completed my uh, organization a, a of the level. tokens. Oops. It's okay, you can do it later. Sorry. Oh, see, I liked... It, it shows you one before you spin it, and I wish I could have just kept it, because it was crazy tiger. <laughs> I, think that, I think that's what it shows all of us. Oh, really? Yeah. Ooh, well, I'm witty bobcat. Do you feel witty? Yeah. For sure. Welcome, Colbridge. Sorry if I'm a little bit lower at you guys. I'm, I made a pirate monkey. Ah, uh, you made a pirate monkey! It's your two favorite things. Yes. Got a... A sore throat and a headache, but that's okay. When we and we've got lovely badger. 
I do want cookies. <coughs> I'm gonna I'm gonna Instacart us some cookies. Cookies. And legend. And by that I mean I'm going to send him to go get his cookies. I like legend deer because it's almost legendary. But it's like legendary. <laughs> I like that. I love seeing people change their profiles or their little pictures. Yeah. Aww. I can understand you wanting Wonder Wolf since you don't have the name Wolf. Sorry that I'm off the stream. Um, typically. He just wants to make sure you're not leaving. I'm not leaving, buddy. Will you get him his blanket while you're at it? Yeah. Oh, he's... he's very grateful. I want cookies. Oh, dog. Dog pets. Pet the dog. You got it. Hi, buddy. They oh. can't see, though. Mr. Duke, Wolf dog. is still happy though. Oh. Wolf Alex's want me to him. Alex's dad came over and helped fix up a broken part on our carport and the um, shelves I wanted in the kitchen. And our house is looking fine. Let me tell you, this is Kirby Kahoot. Yes, we will be doing Kirby Kahoot. Very good Kirby question. Kirby hoot. Yeah, I got shells in the kitchen for all my spices, and I am absolutely over the moon about it. Shelgs. That music was too, too good, too bright, too bouncy. Get it out of here. Mm -hmm. I'm just gonna like pop it together. Yeah. All right, just bring in the couch. Okay. You can pick it up, right? No. Okay. Here we go. Y'all ready? Kirby. Question one. When was Kirby made? 2016, 1985. 2000 or 1992? I think I guessed way too early. Ah, the answer was 1992, of course. See, you can agree with these ones because these are very far apart. Yeah. These are like. These, are, di these are, are different apart. eras of games, yeah. yeah. Honestly, <laughs> they could have put 1980s, 1990s, uh, 2000s, or 2010s. Yeah, maybe um, if you, maybe if you can log in, Colbridge, you can see how many like plays each one has. Oh, that is probably the best way to do it. All right, here we go. Oh, good job. Everybody. Oh, I thought no one got a point. <laughs> no, all three of us got it. What is a boss that is in most Kirby games? A living tree, wispy woods, Landia, or Yin Yarn? <laughs> Um, you guys have probably noticed that Red found a setting that lets you see the uh, questions on your device. So that Which was not there before. Yeah. As we know, because I go, I go through settings menus like nobody's business. Yeah, I mean, DDD maybe could have been in there, but... And not, not a living tree, by the way. That was not a right answer. Nobody got tricked by that one. Even though that's what Wispy Woods is. Okay. Uh, you can never get me. Here we go. How is the finale boss in Kirby's Dreamland? Marks, Mario, Yen Yarn, or DDD? Oh, sorry. Kirby's Dramland. Oh, I did not get that right. Mario. That that is like that is the only Kirby game where DDD is the actual final boss and actually like the bad guy. No, wait! Even in that game, he's not actually he's the possessed. bad guy. 
Yeah. Um, or no, in that game, he is guarding the Star Rod because it's so imprisoning it's the Nightmare. Situation? No, it's a... I don't know, it's a Kirby situation. It's, Kirby, you don't know what you're doing. Don't do this, because then the super ancient evil god will be freed. Who's telling like, you to do freed. it? Kirby. Why does Kirby want to do it? Okay, so the plot of Kirby's Dreamland is... Yeah. Nobody can dream on Dreamland anymore. Okay. Uh, like, everybody, like, can't get to sleep anymore. It's because the Star Rod was split into four pieces by DDD. Okay. And the Star Rod is, like, the thing that, that you know, is in, you know, helps DDD, everybody why'd dream. you do that? So we go collect all the pieces, and then DDD's at the Star Rod, and he's stopping us. And we beat him, and we put the Star Rod back. Which unleashes Nightmare. Because that's what so DDD was trying the to... Real so that yeah, so that's what DDD was trying to prevent, but you know, it turns out he he didn't realize that killing elder gods is Kirby's whole thing. Yeah. apparently, so that's what Kirby does. Yeah, that's what Kirby specializes in. So he just beats it. But yeah, the the only one the only one where he's actually the villain where he does is is Spring Breeze, in in Kirby Superstar. He steals all the food. I kind of feel like stealing food right now. Yeah. Oh, this is the- is this the vocal song? Yeah, get this out of here. Kirby Dreamland, he steals the food? No way, really? I thought it was the Star Rod. Do you mean Kirby's Duramland? Duram- yeah, what about Kirby's Duramland? This is a different game. Today we're going to go on Wikipedia. Oh, am I thinking of I maybe I'm thinking of Kirby's Adventure? Plot. Plot. They Steals steal all the, the food, food in Dreamland, yeah. Oh no, you're right. We're talking about a different game. Nightmare in Dreamland is the one you're thinking of. Nightmare in Dreamland is the Oh, okay. Nightmare in Dreamland is the remake of Kirby's Adventure. Which is the one where you, I believe. Uh, hold on, hold on, hold on. At the time he was going to be named Po Po Po! And the game was named Po 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 with the Spring Breeze and to Twinkle Po Po and Tinkuda Po Po! I just want everyone to read that part. Yeah, so Kirby's Adventure. There's no plot for this one. Uh, yeah, an evil entity named Nightmare corrupts the Fountain of Dreams. King Dedede steals the star rod that powers the fountain and gives pieces to, to his friends in an effort to stop Nightmare. Yeah. Okay, so, and Kirby's Adventure was the first Yet game. another plot that if the characters just talk to- I'm just kidding. It's, it's a 1980s, 90s platformer. I don't think they need to- Yeah, see, so they could have just all talked to each other, except Kirby can't talk, so. Yeah, he can. He says, Poyo! That's not talking. Poyo, poyo. Making them noises is not talking. Poyo. Then Duke can talk when he when he politely asks us to open the door in the middle of the goddamn night. He's not saying words. He's going. Mm -hmm. That's the same thing. Mm -hmm. What's the sound he makes? All right. Question four. What planet does Kirby live in? Earth, Halakandra, Planet Popstar, or Dreamland? The thing I like about this is that. Um... I don't have to feel guilty about clicking my answer right away, because everyone else has the chance to click their answer right away. It is Planet Popstar. Dreamland is like what the continent is called or something? I don't know. But yeah, that's supposed to be Halkandra. There's no A here. Okay, here we go. Who is this? Name that Pokemon! Meta Knight, Dark Matter, Kirby or Galactic Knight? I don't know. I'm not sure. It's Dark Matter. That's actually Dark Matter. It's not Meta Knight. Here we go. Never seen that image in my whole life. Yeah, that's a that that actually is like a deep Kirby cut. Kirby's all about cutting. Okay, here we go. Six out of seven. Who is this? Nova, Marx, or Sweet Stuff? That's Marx. Good old Marx. Nova is the giant clock. It's Max. Okay. 
Okay, here we go. Last one. Who is this? DDD. Shadow DDD. Or Zero Two. Is Zero Two a character? Yes. <laughs> Zero Two is the final boss of, uh, and like the main bad guy in Kirby 64. No way. Yeah. No way. Zero Two. That's, that's its name. <laughs> Oxygen, yeah. Okay, here we go. Who won? Guess what? Doesn't matter. I made a third. Nice. Look at the eyes on that lovely razor. They're freaking out. Okay, that's that's a create.kahoot link, so I'm guessing this isn't gonna work. But I'm gonna try it, just for you, Colbridge. <laughs> oh my god, thank you, Sword of Earth. Nope, that did work. Okay, wow. Let's do it. Zero plays. Alright, we haven't played this one. Here we go. Colbridge Trivia Murder Party 9. Nine. Trivia Didn't you make like 12 of these? Trivia Murder Party with the Colbridge Hotel. Get ready. Did it save all my settings? It did. Okay. Oh yeah, it always shows you Crazy Tiger and Wonder Wolf. Mm -hmm. I am elated deer. Oh, sick. I'm Space Elephant. A light wildcat with a wig and everything. Dr. Head. I'm the light wildcat. <clears throat> Dr. Hen. Nice. I love these. <sighs> what you ordering? I'm just seeing which of the vegan cookie is right now on this event. That seems awesome. Yeah, isn't it? Okay, if, there, if there's anybody else who would like to play with us, who uh, currently cannot for some reason, let us know in chat. We'll help you. Are you guys ready to learn, by the way? We're playing educational games. We are enhancing your brains. You're welcome. I'm still home. Nice, we got Stellar Lark and Melodic Wolf. Too bad, Wolf. You're already, we are, I already tricked you into playing an educational game with us. Stellar Lark, this game's tracking my IP. What's up, Vex? <laughs> look at the look at that. I don't get it. Is Stellar Lark significant to Vex? <clears throat> I won't remember some of these, so I'm not cheating. <laughs> it knows all. Lark is Aussie oh, slang. Oh, you're gonna have to teach us some Aussie slang, Vex. Also, I I didn't realize that when you when you roll over like kicking people, it makes them sad. Look at him, it's like ah oh, ah oh, uh, oh. uh. Okay, here we go. Amazing. Game start. If you want to join in game, the number is going to be at the bottom center. And you do get to see the Which kids live. show did the mean you can't put wind in a box come from? Little Einstein's backyard against Caillou or Bob the Builder. Is that a meme? Learning something today. Have you heard the term Lurkin? Oh. Tell me more. It's apparently a backyardigans. I was not born at the right time for backyardigans to be in my childhood. Which is crazy, because there were six childhoods in, in your 
childhood home. Which of these books is not about a French war? Every book was about a French war. War and Peace, The Count of Monte Cristo, The Centurions, or For Whom the Bell Tolls. I just, I just clicked the wrong button, I'm pretty sure. Colbridge, I do want to say you did a good job in setting the time to be long for anybody that needs longer to read them. It's For Whom the Bell Tolls. Most people oh, I got do it, that. I got it right then, I guess. French wars just get everywhere, don't they? What's up, Mega Mania? Hi, Megan! Did you have a good journey? I hope that. that Which of these islands is, is the closest well? to Florida? The Bahamas, Cuba, the Cayman Islands, or, or Haiti? That's how you pronounce that, right? Florida. Gotta be this, right? Oh, it was not. Oh, okay. okay. Trying to find room for all the things? That makes sense. I hope that what people living here, you are good. What was the name of Theodore Roosevelt's party before he joined the Republicans? These are not. This is. This can't be it. Oh, you don't know this? No. Oh, that's right. I I had like a I had a really good U.S. history teacher who mine, loved all of the presidents. Mine was not as or who loved bad. teaching us about the presidents. I shouldn't say he like idolized them or anything. <laughs> no, because he would tell them he would tell us what like pieces of shit they were. Yeah, they, it, they were great. Uh, yeah, that's the, the only the one bowl that made sense party. to me. The rest of the rest of them, it didn't make sense to have the word bowl in front of them. Roosevelt's the whack guy from the museum? Yes. Yeah, good job. Exactly. Good job. You got it. You got 100%. Okay, here we go. What year did the Roman Empire first invade Britain? Hmm. 109, 215, 55, or 7 BC? Um, Crap. 55. All of us were like, it's probably a hundred years BC. No. Except for uh, Mr. Mr. I'm not cheating over here. What culture's mythology includes an event called the Dreaming? Gauls, Welsh, Goths, or Aborigine? Man, my throat. I want to cut it right off. There's nothing we can do. Oh. Mm. I really like the background with the penguin and the snowflake. Yeah. And the in the little window to the snow outside, which is why the classroom is empty. <laughs> Cause it's a snow day. And somebody left their laptop though, so that's really sad. That's okay, they have a home. I mean this this can't be a red herring, right? It's gotta be the right answer. Wait, aren't all six answers in? Why is it not? Um, Were there maybe, seven people maybe, in? Maybe Wolf was in, and I think Wolf is away, so if you want to hit skip it, you can. Uh, dang it! It wasn't Welsh! You're kidding me. Wait, which Aborigines? Cheers for giving me that one, game. Like, Australian Aborigines? American Aborigines? Russian Aborigines? Yeah, come on, Colbridge. No, like, I'm not trying to be mean. <laughs> I'm just teasing. I'm trying to figure it out. Multi-select. Multi-select. James Bond movies. I, I am going all in. Crap. Wait, the day after tomorrow? Oh, no, wait, not the day after tomorrow. Oh, is it one of those trips? Tomorrow ones? never dies. So I had the word tomorrow. Right? Yeah. That's why only one person got it. With the multi-select, you only get points if you didn't... <gasps> Vex got it. You only get points if you didn't click any wrong answers. 
so less answers is better. You can get partial points, but not if you selected uh, any of the wrong ones. ABBA songs. Man, this remix is going so hard. Fernando, slipping through my fingers. Don't stop thinking about tomorrow or Rasputin. Oh man, I don't know ABBA. Yeah, I, I sure don't. It is Australian Aboriginal, so this is excellent. There is something in the air that night, the sortier. Oh yeah, I gotta just... Yeah, when you get tired of waiting, just hit the skip button. <laughs> the stars are bright. <laughs> I think we know one of Sortier's favorite songs. Fernando Slip. and Slippin' Through My Fingers. But not Rasputin. Novels written by women. Fifty Shades of Grey, Frankenstein, Lord of the Flies, and The Handmaid's Tale. Well, I'm not gonna risk it on the third one, but I know two of these are written by women. I forgot to hit submit. Why is this in such a weird place on desktop? That's a, that's a valid concern. Oh no! I've always thought about reading The Handmaid's oh, Tale. Oh, Fifty Shades of Grey was written by a woman, I'm pretty sure. Look it up. What? Quick. Quick, Google Fifty Shades of Grey. Ruin your, uh... E.L. James. What does that E stand for, huh? Yeah. It, it, it was written by yeah. a woman. Fifty Shades of Grey. Oh! Cheated! Points stolen! It's okay. This is a lark. Okay. Yeah, the reason I haven't read The Handmaid's Tale is because it's too depressing. And now, that being said, I was I, I was totally fine reading, like, other dystopians, like 1984 and Fahrenheit 41 and The Giver, but for some reason, specifically watching, like, women be put into that situation was like, mm, I'm not, I'm not, I can't, I, I can't do that. Yeah. Appropriate use of the word. Yes! We're gonna keep practicing Australian slang. So far, we, we, we only have eight more months to practice it. That's right. Yeah. No, Fifty Shades uh, was written by a woman, That's and, uh -huh. and it wasn't uh, marked as the correct answer. Uh, can you imagine being her partner? And like... like Who's? Uh... The partner of the person who wrote Fifty Shades of Grey. Oh, E. L. James. Yeah, yeah. I, mean, I mean, she definitely has a husband. Like, but she clearly is into men, and she's clearly into a particular type of man. I mean, I mean, yeah. What, what would be wrong with that? You have a lot of money and a wife that likes to get down. I guess. Yeah. <laughs> you, no, I, I'm not saying it's a bad thing. I'm saying, oh. can you imagine, like, oh, now you know, like, what her expectations <laughs> could be. Like, she's written the most famous erotica in the world. Like. What are you gonna do with that? How do you how do you like cope with that? I I think I think you uh I think you uh get a sex coach. <laughs> a coach? A coach <laughs> And you start to, yeah. Oh no. Yeah. Tell me there's not guided sessions. Friends <laughs> episodes. That is that's very true, Vex. The one where that's Ross is true. fine. The stripper cries, no one's ready, or with loose ends. Never watched from. Watched How I Met Your Mother with Alex. True, Bex. Uh, yeah. And I, I was gonna yeah, say, erotic, like, erotic you know, serves a different if, you're, if you're like a comic book writer, you don't expect your partner to be a mutant. No. Erot you're right. Erotica is, is, is very, very different from real. Wow, the only one that was uh, wrong was With Loose Ends. My mom watched Friends every goddamn night. I don't know a single episode name. Yeah, the it's, episode it only It's only there for a second on the screen. Yeah. Unless you are specifically seeking out to rewatch. Or if it's a very famous episode. Psych is a, is a funny show because they have some really, really, like, intricate, like, pun titles that you never see, because I don't think they ever show it on the screen. No. 
It's like only if you're trying to like buy the the season that you see which the funny we, titles. Which we do because we don't have Prime anymore. <laughs> yeah. Donkey Breeds. Psych is a very lovely show. Oh, Psych is amazing. Good feels. Writer's Room just doing it for fun, yeah. American Mammoth Jackstock, Scottish Highland, German Short-Haired Pointer, and Staffordshire. Ah, uh, none of these are real. Yeah, can I select none? <laughs> This OST includes everything. Hey! Four Ooh, of us I got it ticket. exactly right. American Mammoth Jack Stock. Stock. I mean, I think, I think the other ones the are dogs, dog breeds. right? Those are all dog breeds. Oh, I'm I'm on a roll. I'm I've got I'm way fire. Ahead of you. I'm more than a thousand points ahead of you. But I have a fire icon next to my name. I'm very proud of you. Rides in Disney World. You should theoretically remember this. Expedition Everest, Country Bear Jamboree, Runaway Mine Train, and Storm Surge. Is that one still a ride? The one I'm thinking of? Maybe? Or did they construct that? I'm gonna say yeah. Now I'm curious what a fancy donkey show would be like, says Megan. <laughs> Designer donkeys. Only oh. Expedition Everest and Country Bear Jamboree. I knew Country Bear Jamboree. I didn't. I forgot about Expedition Everest. We definitely did not ride on that one. I I remembered Expedition Everest. I don't know if this one's actually at Disney World and called that anymore. Yeah. I'll look it up. Is that Splash Mountain? I feel like that's Splash Mountain. No, it's not. It's One of the very last attractions at Walt Disney personally felt Oh, okay, I think I'm getting it confused with... Oh, it looks awful. With Splash Mountain. An attraction of Frontier... Because it is a waterlog ride, isn't it? Yeah, okay, I remember that. Nope, that checks out. No problems here. Partially correct. Megan, would you bring me some cookies? I'm gonna die if I don't have cookies. Poisonous plants. Not venomous. Dandelion, thistle, foxglove, and forget-me-not. Chelsea would be able to snap-click these. Yeah, for sure. Let me click the only one I actually know. Oh, the only one I actually know is the only correct one! That's one way to make Box questions glove. harder, is to, to do ones that only have one correct answer and be like, what they select? Box. Die. Yes. Oh, well, five correct answers in a row. Don't put it in a sound right now, Megan. You know, wait, there's no dandelions! Anglo-Saxon kingdoms. I think there's like a certain time Wessex, that they taste the best. Mercia, Aquit Aquitaine, and Dyfed. I don't think they taste good though. Yeah, probably not. Otherwise, you'd have them in food a lot more often. I we mean... we pretty much picked out all the plants that taste good, and we put them in a, like a, a ton of foods. Right? True. I mean, tell me I'm wrong. True, but it might also not make sense to farm dandelions. Dang it, I almost died. Or whatever. I lost my streak, but a lady deer did not. Owned by Disney as of 2022. Alvin and the Chipmunks, Scooby Doo, National Geographic, and Pixar.
Yeah, National I got Geographic it. National Geographic and Pixar. Mm -hmm. Scooby-Doo is Hanna-Barbera. I've been in the chipmunks, I don't know. Can you imagine being the one owning the Alvin and the chipmunks IP? <laughs> Desperately. What are you going to do with that? Yeah. Happened in the BC era. Hannibal crosses the Alps. Normans take over England. Alexander the Great invades Persia, and the Roman Empire falls. We are learning so much today. Oh, man, every time I yawn, it's so. Oh, dead got it. Got it wrong. Congratulations, Melodic Wolf. I got second place, and nice. I think we know who got third. <laughs> yep. Okay. Alright, you wanna look for some, some other good ones? Mmm. Mm-hmm. You wanna go get your food? I do like cookies. Are you actually getting food, or are you just like looking at it to make yourself sad? I look at food to make me happy, are you kidding? But no, I'm not getting bagels. Oh, okay. No. Maybe I'll get bagels tomorrow. I want cookies. Victorian quiz. Oh, you know what I'm gonna have for dinner tonight? What? We we, we just did that. Oh. These these questions were like 80% history. Unless you want to make dinner tonight. Um, I don't know. Is it too soon since we last had Chipotle? Oh, maybe. Maybe. Because you always get We same. specifically didn't get tortilla chips, so I'll have to get them there. That's fine. Um, okay. You, you know you can get different things at Chipotle. Like what? Let me read it out. Oh, you're being facetious, aren't you? Um, how about, how about, uh, some, something atomic? Oh yeah, we should do a food quiz after this atomic one. Here we go. Oh, it's just scrolling down. We're scrolling to go find the best ones. They're always buried. Just, just for reference, we ate, like, a couple hours ago, and I'm still very hungry. You can always tell when there's, like, a good one, because they didn't even bother to get like a good picture mm -hmm. if it's just like the first image for the word like Ooh. this vex is gonna go be a degenerate <laughs> okay see you vex have fun with whatever that is Ooh. what's it what's this one is this one good yeah i like this i'm gonna do this one good one this one might not even be very funny but you know what we're trying it oh it doesn't have to be we're just here to be food. Alex made me a sandwich. And bread and turkey and ham and mayo mustard and lettuce. It was good. I want more. Oh man, I wish Cookie Man was playing with us. There is a burger head person. <laughs> yeah. Oh, I'm Rocky Pigeon. I gotta nice. get a good one. We got Lucky Hamster and Sturdy Jaguar. I'm Amusing Glider. I had Singapore noodles today. Ooh, how was that? I like noodles. <coughs> Alex, do you want noodles? Do you like Singapore? Ooh, do you want to go to the noodle Mm, no. I'm not feeling it. You're not feeling the, the noodles? Yeah. The noodle sushi place? What kind of... Would you want any kind of noodles? Um... I don't, it's too soon since I've eaten. Like, I'm not hungry. That is valid and also not at all. I'm, I'm a bird with a pie for my head. That's good. Feed me. Alright, so you are hungry. Go get food! Okay, I'll go get some chipotle. 
I must oh but I could have noodles instead now. I don't think about noodles. <laughs> One of my favorite parts is right before you eat, where you think about all the different foods you could eat. Really? That's yes. the worst part. Oh I love it. I love it. I can be like, oh I could eat sushi. Oh, I could eat noodles. I could have teriyaki. If I could if I, I could, could have, have my way, I, I would just be doing like anything else until I feel hungry and then snap and there'd be a plate of food in front of me. I mean, I don't like driving to go get the food, but I love thinking about all the different foods I could have. No, what you like doing is putting off driving. Well, that's part of it. You're so silly. Um, you all right, let's learn about... Like it's sort of about atomic go, models. I'm gonna go look at the list of foods I can eat. Here we go. Just think about all the foods I could be eating. Thank you for the follow! Hope you're enjoying. Who gave Adams their name? Was it Ernest Rutherford, J.J. Thompson, Democritus, or Niels Boring? The Boring model. Science is best. It was Democritus! you can't divide the, the atoms anymore. They're indivisible. Crazy. Who identify electrons? He thought an atom resembled plum pudding or a chocolate chip cookie. John Dalton, J.J. Thompson, Heisenberg and Schrodinger, or Bert and Ernest. I like these distractors. These are good. Well, this guy was on the previous question, so he must be important. That's what I picked. Nice! I was right! Because you said that, I picked the same CONTEXT movie. CLUES! So you get smart like me. Smart like me, I say in last place. Who described the atomic theory? John Dalton, Democritus, Ernest Rutherford, or Niels Bohr? Are you in, Megan? She's gonna get- she's gonna get first place. Oh, that's some big expectations for your sister. J.J. Thompson has a plum pudding sort of name. Wow, lucky hamster. Kinda killing it right now. Who said the atom was mostly empty space? Ernest Rutherford, J.J. Okay, I'm, I'm sensing a, uh, a theme here. Uh, maybe you? Maybe it's finally you? I'm just trying to, yeah, trying to pick someone who hasn't been picked yet. No, uh, no, that was Ernest Rutherford. Who said electron buzz around in a cloud? Niels Bohr, J.J. Thompson, Schrodinger's cat, or Heisenberg and Schrodinger? I don't know the cat could talk. That one was Heisenberg. Uncertainty principle. You're goddamn right. <laughs> you. Who said atoms are like small, hard balls? The billiard ball. J.J. Thompson, Ernest Rutherford, Niels Bohr, John Dalton. Soiled. It said, it said, the that atoms where small soiled spheres. That's really good. Uh oh. Small soiled spheres. Someone smashed their hand onto the keyboard. Who did not edit that? Who soiled these spheres? Yeah, I'm concerned. Who said atoms are pieces of matter that could not be cut anymore? Uncuttable. Democritus, John Dalton, J.J. Thompson, or Niels Bohr? Hey, Alex. What? Did you notice what happened there? The name was on the picture. Oh, shoot! <laughs> I didn't... I didn't... I didn't see that. I'm busy reading the options. Who said negative electrons orbited in shells like planet orbit the sun? Like planets orbit the sun. I know this one. You know this one? Mm-hmm. Well, it's, I guess it's... Oh. Nice. Did you get four? Oh. No, it's no, the one I, time I didn't I'm guess the only one that, four. That one I know just because it's called the Bohr model. And you know what the fun thing is? What's the fun thing? Many of these models are right in different ways. Because quantum mechanics are freaking weird. Nice. <laughs> Who did experiments with gold foil? He shot particles that bounced off the nucleus. I don't know. Bill Nye's on the list! 
Bill Nye, J.J. Thompson, Niels Bohr, Ernest, Ernest Rutherford. Radioactive source. I love that the radioactive source is just like a pink glow in a box. I feel like that needs more explanation. I am sitting dead last in this one. I'm not, I'm not smart. I don't put me in your nuclear facility. This electron cloud model is our current model. It was discovered by... Niels Dalton, Schrodinger and Heisenberg, John Dalton, or Niels Bohr? That one's, that one's the Schrodinger and Heisenberg. I don't know who Bill Nye is, says Coleridge. Google it! He's, uh, he's, a uh, he's like, he makes, or he made, a bunch of, uh, kids shows that explain science that are really famous around here. Nice job, Lucky Hamster. I made it in the second place. Rocky Pigeon, Sturdy Jaguar. And all you other losers like me down at the bottom. Okay. Okay, are you getting yourself food or no? Top five. Awesome job. There were six people. I will get myself food at some point. But right now I'm still in the, the, the feelings thing. You are so weird. You're like so. If you wait m much longer, you're not gonna have any energy to go get the food. Oh, I'm fine. Oh, I've been meaning to try this place that's right down the road. Maybe I'll try it. Yeah, you should, because I don't want that kind of food. Okay. Food quiz? Taco quiz? Um. I do like food quiz. Let's do fast food quiz. No, no, I don't want to think about fast oh, food. Oh, yeah, no, they would be... I'll do that. Um, how about... Is there, like... Pastry review? Oh, re uh, review is, I like, I see. Um, why are these all called pastry review? Like, there's so many of them that are called that. That's that's just strange to me. Like, is this just okay? You you like macarons, Wolf? Well, that's 45, jeez. Okay, hold on. <laughs> Pastry chef. Okay. okay. I found it. Diet quiz. Alright, we got we got a new one. Get in here, Sriracha. Oh, sweet. You could, like, split-screen it. Yeah, it probably makes sense if you are. I'm fast full. I got super cat. Wait, is there no cat? Oh, I guess this is supposed to be a cat. Oh, that's a pretty, that's a pretty awful-looking cat. Yeah, this cat is, like... Crazy bad. Rock star camel. <coughs> Aw, Colbridge is a friendly rabbit. Okay, let's go. Are you ready for for pastry chef? What year was Paul Hollywood born? 95, 64, 45, or 66? What? What? What are we doing? <laughs> what are we doing? 1966. Next question. 
What is the French word for pastry? Patissier or chinem? I, I think he's a he's a baker. Patissier. Next question. What is a pretzel? It is a non-symmetrical form. Treacly, unsweetened, or tasteless. It is a non-symmetrical form, I guess. These what? were in bold. Why were these in bold? What is going on? But he was age no, what? when his dad died. What? What? 18, 19, 17, or 13. Alex, what did you do? Pastry chef. What? 17. I like how it, many... it, it was Buddy Goldbridge. I'm amazed that many of us got that. Did you learn something new? No, did you lean something new? Yes, no, don't know, don't care. Yes. Only yes is correct. Only yes. I like, yes. I like that. Kieran the Kipper, thank you. Thank you. For the follow, I hope you're enjoying. I hope you're a pastry chef now. Okay. Um, let's do one, let's do one about... Let's do one about internet. I love all these thumbnails. Okay. Internet research all oh, wait wait wait. Oh no wait, this is a top pick. Hold on, we can't pick we can't pick that one. Can't wait to learn about Buddy's dad in my baking course. Oh yeah. I mean Buddy's dad is is uh, is dead, alright? You be nice to Buddy. Are you headed out? Uh I'm texting a uh Gotcha. Oh Kieran the Keeper, thank you for the raid. Oh my gosh, that's funny, the follow, the follow, um, notification took it over. Thank you. Oh my goodness, what a, what a crazy, uh, <laughs> screen full of emotes here. And thank you, oh, I, and hold on, I'm, I'm behind on my notifications. Thank you, Marcus the number one, your average gamer, Yoki Takano, and not Logan. For the follows. Thank you, all of you. Should we do a? Di I saw Disney. Should we do Disney? Let's try and find Disney. So, so around here, when we're playing cahoots, we like to, we like to go by. Uh, we, we like to scroll down a bit, get to the real diamonds in the rough. You know, the one, the ones with, that didn't even bother to like capitalize the title. Pushing you to the top of Kahoot, nice! Number one Kahoot streamer on Twitch, that's that's right here. How are you? Doing great. We're having fun. Doing some some silly viewer games. Alright, let's see let's see if we find some good ones. Colors with cars. Oh yes, and thank you, Chell's Plays, for the follow as well. Oh my gosh, I'm I'm like tuning out the notification now. That's my bad. I kind of just have the music down here. <laughs> I Spy? That's Disney official. A lot of these are Disney official. I'm just realizing like all of these are like verified. Hold on. How do we get to, how do we get to like not verified? How about highest quality but we go to like the last one. Is that, is that... I don't know. I don't know if we can get if we can get to the crap hoots with with all these uh, with all these official accounts. We were top for the past three hours. Oh, nice! You do a similar thing. Okay, all these all these are official. How do, how do we get to the My not order official? is in place, and I see that you have had some uh, <laughs> some excitement over here. Yes. <laughs> that's ex that's pretty chill. We're we're trying to find some something Disney that's like unsanctioned, you know. Oh, nice! Something not made by Disney. Yeah, 
But but uh, Disney makes a lot of these apparently. Yeah. Like there's somebody at the at the Disney offices who's just cranking these out, man. They're working hard. Okay. Oh, here we go. Now see, this is this is what we look for. Mm -hmm. Disney movie characters, all lowercase. This is the kind of quality we want. You think it's oh, but it's, it's too no, easy. it's just who is Look, this? Do you notice? This, who did you know this? the caption? Notice the caption was "This is easy." This is easy. Oh no, it's all just who is this? Why do we keep seeing this one car? By the way, <laughs> well, what, what's going on with that? Well, it seems like they're all the same ones, but just in different languages. You might be able to sort by English. I don't think so. I don't think there's like filters. Oh, never mind. There's literally a thing that says filters. Uh. Okay. Only English. Maybe. Maybe social and students only. Yeah, just not business yeah. users. <laughs> that great one. Nope, that still gets us Disney. Disney official. No, is there a way to get it off? Mm. What, how? What? How would? They, how are they a student? Are they a student? Are they a social? They're a social user, Maybe? I guess. There's no getting rid of it. <laughs> they're they're above it all. They 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 yeah. Above okay, never mind. I gotta I gotta get a quiz going so we can like do a quiz here. It's okay, just scroll. Just, just we're just scroll. gonna keep scrolling. Just scroll. <laughs> There's that car again! Try not to look at the car. That one car. That's like their favorite car. Come on. Keep scrolling. That, that one was in all caps. But it has like 500,000 plays, so... Yeah, no. So that, one's, that one's gonna be... It had, yeah. It had some good questions, though. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Maybe we should just do that There's one. There's Disney though. that's 10 questions. Try that one. Di this one? That one could be good too. Or are you talking about this one? Yeah, either one. Uh, let's see. Oh, yes. do this one, do this one. Oh, this do is do good because it has Ice Age it in there, which is not even Disney! Yeah. There we go, we found a good one. We found the crap hoot we were looking for. Okay, alright. Here we go. Sorry to spoil the Ice Age question, by the way. I don't, we don't know the answers. I'm Classy Glider. I got I got the animal Oryx, which I have no idea what, what animal that is. Hmm. Hey, thanks, your average gamer. Get some good sleep. Thank you for stopping by. Rest well. Oh, I'm making Classy Glider very sad. Yeah, how dare you make me sad. Oh my gosh. The light is like, look, it's like washing out my entire neck. That's crazy. I ordered the orange chicken, which they said didn't have milk in it, and hot stickers. Just like... I didn't really change it to... No, I can think it did. Hi. I'm busy! Okay, here we go. What is the tiger's name in Aladdin? Princess, Vihan, Raja, or Arav? I got it! Who's Raja? Huh, that's a good question then. What is Mulan late for in the beginning of the movie? Her charm school exam, going to war for her father, her wedding, or working for her family? 
Yeah, she draws a nice, like, goatee on that lady. It's her charm school. She's bad at charm school because she's not a good lady. What is the robot's name in Big charm Hero school. 6? Hero Hamad, Baymax, Wally, or Baymax? I love Big Hero 6. It's just so good. <laughs> trick, trick question, it's Nanobot. What can the squirrel in Ice Age never get? Acorns, pecans, peanuts, or a lady squirrel? <laughs> Baymax, yeah. B-A-E, Max. <coughs> Please tell me there are Disney branded Valentine's Day cards that have the Baymax on them. Probably not. You'd be surprised what kind of Valentine's Day cards they put out. Who plays Captain Jack Sparrow? Johnny Depp, Orlando Bloom, Jack Davenport, or Dylan Smith? Dylan Smith isn't a real person. It's Johnny Depp. Please. When a monster touches a human, what quarantine code is called? 3517, 1000, 2319 or 1765. We have a 2319! <laughs> oh yeah, cause isn't it because 2319 is like cause 23 is Y and 19 is S cause it, it literally it's like yellow sock or something, right? Or no, 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 it's, um, 23 isn't Y, it's something else. Oh yeah, it's it's W, isn't it? Yeah, it's W. So it was, it's literally W-S. White sock. Like, that's the code that they're calling. It's so specific. The music stops so you could think. That's funny. What kind of animal is Nemo's teacher? An eel, a seahorse, a turtle, or a stingray? I think I remember. Socks are dangerous and do yeah. different measures based on color. Is he a stingray? Yeah, he's all like I know he's a ray. He's like a he's like oh, a, well, we don't know if he's a ray. A yeah, but is he actually a stingray? Like, does know. he have a stinger? I think he's just a manta ray. Is a manta ray the same thing as a stingray? By the way, I have no idea. In Monsters, Inc., what do they collect in the yellow tubes? Fear, screams, dreams, or tears? Screams. I loved when he, like, yeah, the, the thing they were showing there, where he, like, twists one out and it starts screaming. Like, makes all the lights go crazy. I loved that. That was great. Who kills Simba's father? Nulla, Rafiki, Scar, or Buffaloes? Oh, wait, hold on. Wait, hold on. Okay. Oh, what? No, it was them, though! No, was it Buffaloes that were trampling him or someone else? Wasn't him? it like Water Buffalo? Wow, okay. That's... I mean, he also probably would have just died from falling that far. No, he was tough. He could have made it. Long live the king. What does Ariel give up for legs? Her voice, true love, her crown, or a tail? Well, <laughs> how is her tail not also a correct answer? She does. She doesn't have a tail anymore. Her <laughs> sins. Her sins. <laughs> wow. That's a very different telling of that movie. No, I think she's going up there to gain more sins. <laughs> what do all Disney princesses need to fix their struggles? True love, magic, nice hair, or true love's kiss? The only correct answer here is nice hair. 
They have flawless hair. <laughs> what? It's true love's kiss. Really? Yeah. In every single one? <laughs> well, not, not really, but pretty much. Does, like, the redhead girl, does she kiss her mom to turn her back? And I think Elsa just freaking hugs Anna. <laughs> They're not all doing kisses. Um, angry. Nah, it's kisses though. This is gonna cause some problems. What does Nemo live in? An anemone, a mammamamamamamamamamamamamamamamamamamamamamamamamamamamamamamamamamamamamamamamamamamamamamamamamamamamamamamamamamamamamamamamamamamamamamamamamamamamamamamamamamamamamamamamamamamamamamamamamamamam
<laughs> Just on loop for an hour. Yeah, I'm uh, sure there's a 10 hour video. Oh, Fire Emblem, that's a good one. I got to to the list. Oh, Donkey Kong! Oh, oh, the Donkey Kong music that was in Donkey's video really impressed me. But yeah, we'll play that later. Okay. Donkey Kong is really good music. Power Rangers. All of our games. Three, two, one, let's go. How did the Rangers defeat Madame Odious? Combined energy with Preston's spell, with a Mega Zord, none of the above, or with their powers alone without combining them? You gotta love a none of the above. I like combined the energy. Who knows what energy? Just the energy. Well, morphin energy, I think. I yes, guess, yeah. I got it right. The energy. <laughs> I can't believe it. <laughs> How did they defeat Galvanax? It's all gonna be final bosses. None of the above. Well, these aren't final bosses. These are, like, literally episode bosses. Done oh, wow. a final attack with the Nexus Prism. Used their power, or Megazord. <laughs> I just love Megazord. Like, not even, like, used Megazord, like last one. Just Megazord. Well, it's funny, because Megazord is one word. <laughs> yeah. Um... So this is not Megazord, this is Megazord. They've done a final attack with the Nexus Prism. Yeah, obviously. Okay, here we go. Who makes the Ninja Stars? Good question. Mike, Redbot, Mike and Redbot, none of the above. No picture. No picture, because you can't show them. Uh... Oh, John, there's a comment in the chat that you can help us out with. Uh, it, it's Power Rangers. Oh, I didn't have the question. I'm distracted. <laughs> oh, wait, but everybody did. I think. Unless there's. Oh, maybe there's somebody new in now. Oh, okay. It's Mike, Redbot, and Mike and Redbot. And they're all correct. How kind. It, it's too violent? I don't know. Yeah, it's too violent. Watch. Uh, I can't read it here. No Power Rangers, it's too violent. Watch Ninja Turtles instead. Watch Ninja Turtles! What is the name of the actor who plays Brody Romero? William, Zoe, Tyler, or none of the above? I actually don't even know this. I think this is... Brody with like four spaces, Romero? Yeah, Brody... <laughs> yeah, it is! <laughs> Romero. You're right. Brody... Romero. Well, this is also all about ninja steel? <laughs> yeah, it's only one. It's only one of the Power Rangers. Oh, it's, it was William. It probably still is. <laughs> no, that's, no, that's a... No, no. Nope. I'll, I'll delete it for you. Wrong. He was reading... He was translating... A chat message. That doesn't count. Let's read. That's that reading chat. Hardly. Who is the actor who plays Sarah? I do like that we we couldn't have found <laughs> questions to ask other than like name the actors now. Christy Ann, Zoe Robbins, Brody, or none of the above. Big fan of. We've already established Brody as a character and yeah. not an actor. <laughs> Oh, it was apparently Christy Ann. Who plays Levi from Power Rangers Ninja Steel? Jordy Weber, Jordy Austin, Jordan, or none of the above? Jordy Weber, I got it. I, I guessed it. I didn't know it. Okay, last question. Here we go. Who is the actress who plays Haley? Yeah, it's just, just actresses though. Zoe Robbins. Zoe Robinson. Zoe. None of none of the above. None of the above. <laughs> Let 
None of the above. It's Zoe Robin. Apparently Zoe is not correct. I figured I would get get by like I did with Redbot. No. But no. No. Full full names only. I don't know why I remember that particular detail about Ninja Steel. I <laughs> Uh, Wolf, we do not, we do not add quotes from non-streamers. We, we add quotes from, from the streamers only. But I, I did not do it. I was rapid, Dingo. Lucky Rooster got it. Nice, nice work, Lucky Rooster. What a lucky, lucky Rooster answer. Rooster pizza? I think so, yeah. Okay. There's a burger, too. Go. Oh. Did, was she, like, actually leaving for real? She said she's coming right back. She said, I will be back shortly, for her words. I don't know what she's doing. She got second place, despite, like... Despite leaving the room on question five of seven. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, that's about right, isn't it? Yeah. Just goes to show how much skill it takes to answer these questions. Okay, here we go. Um, yeah. how about... God of War. God of War? I'm just suggesting that. I'm just here. God of War 4? It's three questions in that one. Not Technoblade, thank you for the follow. Okay. This one just says Call of Duty Black Ops? <laughs> Games. 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 Okay. Dude, actually, we're, I think we're already getting into the weeds here. Let's, let's, uh, God of War, easy questions. Recognize the person is a really good question name. Um... I do like What's the idea of also you picking that games quiz. Games, Just call yeah. It games. Okay, here we go. Three question quiz. Oh, here we go. Let's this, go. Baby. This is this is all this is all you need. Games. Do the games one. Okay, we'll we'll go back for games. Oh my god, I'm gentle duck. Nice, I'm majestic kitten. Am I a brain with a hat? I'm a brain with a hat. Wow. Oh my god, I can be a brain with a scarf. <laughs> this is such a cozy brain. Nice, we got another lark. A Agent Sphinx? Whoa. Okay, here we go. God of War 4. What is the first boss you fight in God of War? A troll? Or a dragon? I don't know. Bad guys. I don't know the answer, but I... I, I really like... I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> like, you could just be glib and unhelpful. Why don't you get to pick username? Uh, because it just randomly makes you one, and I think that's funnier. And besides, it, it discourages people from, uh, joining via bot. Or if they do join via bot, they don't get to write offensive things for no reason. Exactly. Which, uh, which happens. Who is Kratos' dad? Zeus. Or a giant. He is has no dad. Can find out? I don't know. I... Yeah, do we ever get to know who his dad is? Zeus? What? Is that a thing? No, it's not. No. <laughs> it is definitely it's not, not Zeus. I have returned. What are you guys are playing? You? Oh, wow, you were fast. Yeah, there's a reason I picked it. It's for your house. Oh, like you left the building and and came back. Wow, that was we, we just learned that uh, Kratos' dad is apparently Zeus. Zeus. Yes. Different guy. No relation. Did Kratos kill? Has dad. Yes, no, maybe, I don't know. I, well, I well, guess... Well, does he... I guess it depends. I, yeah, like... <laughs> I guess if we're saying he did, it's He did Zeus. kill Zeus. 
<laughs> All of the above. There we go, we did it. Nice, good job, smooth lark and gentle duck. And majestic kitten, but that one's me. Okay. Uh, Games. Here we go. Games by Focused Elephant. Oh, dude, watch, that people food. Oh, he definitely does. He's not. Oh, my. Here we go. This, this... The sweet lady there, because the place recently opened, was like, Oh, how did you hear about us? I'm like, uh, I live next door. <laughs> I can see my house. Yeah. <laughs> it's smiling at me. I am a... I'm knowing lemur. I appear to be a duck wearing a turkey. Oh, that's gruesome. Oh, yikes. Dazzled possum, baby. <laughs> Golden bear. Okay, here we go. Are you in? I'm in. Oh. Sorry, let me uh, get in. What's this one? Uh, this games. is games. Mm. It came up while we were searching for God of War. Oh, of course, of course. Okay, only real gamer gods will be able to get these questions. Oh yeah, certainly. Mm -hmm. Here we go. The the true test. Question one, who is this Call of Duty character? Mason, Hudson, Woods, or Nikita Dragovich? Hmm. There was an IDK button on these. <laughs> it's Mason, apparently. How does everybody, how does everybody get that but me? I, I guess. So rigged. He didn't look like a Nikita Dragovich to me. <laughs> I know, he looked like he could have been a villain, and, and making the Russians a, a villain is a very Call of Duty thing to do. It's true. Who is this? Nikita Dragovich, Woods, Reznov, or Hudson? Well, I don't think it's... It's, uh, it's Red, Mason. You see, the most game game there is, is Call of Duty. That's Woods, yeah, you could tell because he had... You could tell. He had wooded camo. What is this map? Nikita Dragovich. Simple <laughs> firing range, dome, or nuke town. So when they said games, they meant Call, Call of, Duty. of Duty. And there's one particular oh, Call sorry. of Duty, I think. Is there, are there other games? <laughs> yeah, there's, there's the other Call of Duties. That's it. Okay, here we go. Double points. Who are the main baddies in Black Ops 1? Frederick Steiner, Victor Reznov, Les oh, Kravchenko, or Nikita Dragovich. Uh, I'm doing it for the meme. You're doing all four of them. No, I just didn't. Oh, I forgot. There's multiple. I picked all Russian ones. I only clicked Nikita. Oh. I, yeah, I, I clicked Nikita and Kravchenko because they're just the very much Eastern European names. Yeah. But I didn't get Steiner. Okay, true or false, when you beat COD Black Ops 1, do you go into zombies? Go go into? Like, does it just immediately transition to its zombies mode now? I think so, actually. Does it actually do I, that? I, I, I thought I remembered it doing something like that. I remember being surprised by zombies. I wow. Remember, like, I remember I played that game and then suddenly I was playing a zombies thing. I don't know why, though. Apparently this it's true. Many years ago. True or false? Does Kratos have a brother? Here we go! Here we go! Games! <laughs> well, it depends on your use of okay, verb what does tenses. What brother mean? <laughs> like, have or, or, or has. Had. Fuck yeah, games! We got a different game, Soraya. What?! So the two games are Call of Duty and Duck God of War. Yeah. So far. But we've got like four questions left. Who is the main baddie in God of War 3? 
baddie being capitalized. I like capitalized that it's always baddie. <laughs> Zeus, Hades, Kratos, or Kronos? <laughs> I guess, well, there's an argument for, for yellow, isn't there? Yeah. <laughs> there's an argument for him being the baddie in every game. Yeah. But no, it's Zeus. No, that's the, one, that's the one where he finally goes and kills Zeus. Yeah. God of War for, like, the PS4, I feel like he's... He, that one you can't really make an argument that he's the baddie in that okay, one. Okay, yeah. The bad guy's Mimir. <laughs> <laughs> that know-it-all fuck. You could make an argument for it, for it in the newest one. Who is this? From Odin's perspective. Kronos, Kratos, Pandora, or Hades? No, it's Zagreus. Zag. Who is this? Always with the who is this questions. Marcus Phoenix, Dominic Santiago, Damon Baird, or Anthony Carmine. I don't know his name. I know that's the guy from Gears of War, though. Yep, it's 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 Mr. It's John Gears of War. Do you know him? Do you, do you know his name? Or, I think so. Guess? Yeah. Yeah, he's Marcus Phoenix. Okay. Okay. Yeah. So I just guessed. So the real games are the ones where male characters, the protagonists, and they're also super buff. I mean, yeah. Yeah. Those are all the games. Yeah, the, game, the games that exist are God of War, Call of Duty Black Ops, and Gears of War. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Two of them have the word war in it. Who is this? The Queen, Lambit, Ram, or Scourge? Do you know who that is? I don't know who that is. I don't know. She kind of looks like a queen. You're, you're a games player. She's the queen! She, yeah. That was the only explicitly female one. So. Yeah. You're a games player, you should know such things. <laughs> I should. True or false? Double points. Does Anthony Carmine die? Spoiler! True or false? Follow up question. Who the fuck is Anthony Carmine? That guy. <laughs> True. He does die, though. God, we are all so Statistically good. speaking, everyone dies. Does Anthony Carmine die? I mean, is but true. not necessarily in video games. Nice job knowing Lemur and Dazzled it. Possum and Alex, Smiling Rooster. I know this probably won't result in us finding a crap hoop, but please, 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 can we do a Hades one? Because I want to see how much I know about it. Okay. Every question's gonna be, who is this? Who, yeah, who is this? Okay. Oh! He's giving us the webtoon. Yeah. Is there any super giant Hades? Um... It's okay if there's not. Is it this one? Uh, I, but I, I think we should do this, though, absolutely. Ooh, what? Um, Every what? I think we should get in there. Okay. No, 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 don't play I don't this! Know, I don't know what this no. is, but I am here for it. Yeah, we're, we're not playing this. We're doing... Oh, what? This one is so dumb that it's, like, crossed the threshold. Oh, boo! This so one, this, won't one play it. this was made for for a specific group of eleven year olds, <laughs> and we're not a part of that group, and that's pretty funny. It is pretty funny. Don't you wish you were part of that group of eleven year olds? Can you imagine what Kahoot you would have made for each other if Kahoot was around when you guys? Oh my were god, in? we would have made some stupid garbage. Yeah. See? Although we didn't know each other when we were eleven. True. We didn't. No. Oh no, but, I was yeah, in that's too young. Seventh grade. Oh, nice, I'm your great aunt. <laughs> I'm a kind onyx. I'm a kind duck. To, oh, you got the oryx. I we we it's don't like the what? O O R Y X. Oh, we have oryx. no idea what like what animal that is. Oh, is that is that the pun that onyx is supposed to be a pun title of? What? O R Y X. It's an you know? antelope. Oh, okay. Oh, so this is like a magical thing? No, so it's a real animal. No, I meant like the oryx is like a magical. No, no, it's a, the no, oryx. No, no, it's a real animal oh. from Africa. It's an antelope. Oh. I, I am saying there's a Pokemon named O N Y X. Oh. That's and I, ju to be, I just puzzled that out. Be a play on oryx. Okay. Oh, I didn't even. I, I didn't get that. Right now also. Okay, here we go. A quiz about the game Hades. This is what you wanted. This is what I wanted. Who is this? <laughs> Always with the who Fantastic. is this. Fantastic. Poseidona, Poseidon, Prisium, 
Or Zeus. I can't wait for more Zeus. Zeus. It's so easy with these Greek mythology quizzes. Yeah. Can't have a who without who is this. Yeah, who is this? Who is this? I promise there are more questions than that. Zed, Poseidon, or Zeus. Didn't even make a fourth answer there. How could you? He's holding a lightning bolt. Is Hypnos a friend of Zagreus? True or false? <laughs> Debatable. Not debatable. I'm just I mean, kidding. in my brain, he is because you don't actively fight him at any point. <laughs> That's so far. No, they're but, done with the game. But true or false means you have to make a statement. Yeah, right. You're not wrong. <laughs> okay. True or false, does Zagreus have two uncles? Um. That's a confusing question to answer. Does he have, I think he has more than well, that. Well, I think... Making it a true-false question makes it really confusing to answer. <laughs> yeah. He, he does. It's it's Zeus and Poseidon. This is a good crap yeah. you gotta admit. It's... I will admit. Who are Zagreus's... Oh, well... <laughs> sorry. <laughs> Spoilers. Is it Poseidon and Zeus? Poseidon and Zeus? See? Or Poseidon this and Zeus. Classic crap food. I do like right the here. the inability to capitalize. Yeah, it's really intriguing to me. Like capitalize sometimes, but not always. Right. If, if you miss one, just it's fine. <laughs> yeah. Really easy question: Is this Zagreus's dad? True or false? That implies that it's really <laughs> easy. Like that is true. <laughs> really easy question. I feel like I do. I, I appreciate when quizzes goad me. Yeah. <laughs> Not really. Another really easy question: Does Hades take place in the underworld? Oh my god! Like, I mean, I know what the answer is, but like, there is a case to be made for it being the other one. Mm -hmm. <laughs> there, they got fifty-two plays out of this one. I told you this what was a collectibles good idea. do you need to unlock weapons? Now here's a that's well, nothing. They, they, that's nothing. It's they, it's like not just a solidly black image though. There's like there's like JPEG artifacting see, on this it. This is the first good question. <laughs> Look, like do you see? It's not <laughs> solid black. So they what? took a picture of something. Yeah. <laughs> I feel like if we look at this image for long enough, we'll see like a demon. Don't, right. Don't keep looking. Okay. What is Hades' dog called? Cerberus, Koo, or Hypnos? <laughs> no. Big fan of Koo. Koo, yeah. Koo from like Kirby's Dreamland Three. Oh, is that a real dog name? No, it's like a it's an owl or yeah. something, yeah. Because it, you know, Koo. Cool. That would make sense. Explain to me nothing. <laughs> That's the sound the owls make. No, it's not. They go Koo. Same yeah. thing. Yeah. <laughs> Pet doggo. That's not a question. True or false. <laughs> uh, uh, again, with the, like, this is a picture taken with a camera in the dark. Horrifying. True or false. Is doggo good? True. Sweat levels increasing. <laughs> doggo is good. Who said false? That quiz went off the rails so Fast? Yeah, but but good thing we still got our who is this questions. Yeah, four of them I or beat, whatever it was. I beat Alex by less than 100 points. Wow. I do like that we only identified three separate people in that thing. It was Zeus, Poseidon, and Hades. Yeah. <laughs> None of the other gods or characters. There was exactly one good question. It was how do you unlock weapons? Yeah, and even then they only gave two answers. Yep. I know. <sighs> Well, that was really stupid in the best way. Exactly, shows me. This person doesn't know how to do true false. Okay. Um, you can do your own now. Okay, how about... Bowling for soup. Bowling. I don't know what kind of questions you could make about bowling. Oh but... man, there's some dark stuff in there. Don't worry about it. Energy equations. Purchase? That's a- there's one that's just a gun. Yeah. It's just a gun. Don't uh, look at that apparently one. there's a book. Yep. Um, 100th day of school. There's one only question. one question. And it's, 
100 plus 100, mm. 269, 938, or 438. That's a hard one. And it's a poll. It's not, <laughs> there is no correct answer. We're voting on how math works. Yeah. I love that. You know why it came up? Why? It was written by Richard Bolin. <laughs> Did you see? What? Click on it. No, it wasn't Ethan Daniels. What? Richard Bowling. No, that's the description. The description is Richard Bowling. <laughs> what is this? Don't click on that. We're gonna end up Please weird. Click on that. We're gonna we're gonna some weird stuff. Oh shoot! I tried to click on it. Be, be, be prepared to click away if you need to. Bowling with horse racing. Click. Oh. Oh, it's all it's all in a it's in, oh. in a different language. Okay. Uh, let's let's do. Okay, we're we're getting we're getting too far away. I kind of forgot about that movie, to be honest with you. Um. Yeah, I don't know it. Bowling oh, seventy two. I just fully forgot. About okay, it. here we go. This is good. The bowling with the horse racing picture? I didn't even see that one. What? Mm -hmm. Oh, there was. Mm -hmm. Oh, but it's 28 questions. Mm -hmm. We can't do that one. We don't have the attention span for that. Oh, did you try? Uh, no, I'm not very hungry, thank you. Mm -hmm. John, you can totally try it, but... I think I have Alex's cold, so... <laughs> Ruby. You, you don't think that was a different language. I guarantee you that it was. Well, it's a different language other than English and a language that Alex does not speak. Yeah. Oh, champion, dude. It, know, it knows I love food. It keeps giving me the pancakes on the head. <laughs> it does. It knows what I'm about. <laughs> I never said that. Why is Dandy Lizard? Oh, your mouse was over it, and so it was. Oh, funny. yeah. I, just, I didn't realize that that was. It's funny, they're like sad because they're about to get kicked. Yeah. I, I was like, why is his sad end crossed out? Like, what happened? Okay, here we go. <laughs> bowling. Quiz about bowling. We can all learn about bowling together. Let's go. What is one thing that is not needed for bowling? Special shoes, a helmet, money to rent a lane, or a pencil to write your score? Why did they list the purposes for the other things? <laughs> that kind of ruins it. J just say, like, a pencil. A helmet for when your girlfriend inevitably chucks it behind you. I mean, you really don't need a pencil, though. This is 2023. No. no. Every bowling alley on Earth has a computer. Mm -hmm. Oh, he's jealous. What is the word that means you knock down all ten pins with one ball? Strike, home run, points, or goal? Yeah, that shows me what was pointing out, too. Yeah, we need food. Goal. Pins look like bottles, triangles, sticks, or balls. Now that I think about it, they must have originally been bottles, huh? Yeah. I guess so. I actually know that because of Power Rangers. <laughs> <laughs> of course. When a player knocks down all the balls in two strikes, it is called all the balls? In two strikes, <laughs> it is called a spare, Oops. strike, foul, or goal. And in two strikes, also. <laughs> in two strikes. Yeah. What do you What do you call a a, a thing? Is it a roll? Is a, it a, a throw? A frame. A frame. Well, no, the frame is the whole thing. Is when all the pins are not. Yeah, I, I think I think it's a throw. There's two absurdities in that question. Yeah, thank you. I was so I was so concentrating on two strikes that, or sorry, all the balls. I didn't even realize. And two I did strikes. the opposite. I was focused on the strikes thing when I didn't that I didn't catch the balls part, which there was so much wrong. Okay, it's okay. It'll get better. What do you need to do after you change into your bowling shoes? I don't feel like it's getting better. Write down your score. Pay to rent a lane. Get a bowling bowl or set up the <laughs> pins. I think I clicked the wrong one. I actually. It's not get a okay. bowling ball. See, I was like, wait, they don't give you the shoes <laughs> every day. So yeah. I, I clicked the wrong one. What the heck? You can't. You, you, they don't give you the shoes. But I feel like this was made by an eleven-year-old. <laughs> oh. So I feel like their dad goes to rent the thing. The, someone hands them the shoes and they put on their shoes and then they think, okay, well, now we're. I think for the this lane. is for a school bowling club. 
Yes. And so they brought their own bowling shoes because they're I in see. a bowling club. I can't believe it. I I wanted them to have a bowling bowl. How does a person win a bowling game? He or she knocks down the most pins in 10 frames. The player who makes a strike on each turn. The player who makes the most spares. Or the person who knocks down the least number of pins. That's, that's golf. <laughs> I love the idea of bowling where you try not to knock anything down. But with bumpers up. Right. I was gonna say, Shosni, yeah, like if you if you get a strike on each turn, you win. That is true. Also, oh, I didn't even think about that. That is really funny. <laughs> People have done that, right? Yeah, how many yeah. games exist in bowling? How many frames are in each bowling game? 5, 10, oh. 7, or 19? Well, you just told us last question. They did? I was yeah. not paying attention. In one of the answers, it said it. Heck. You don't know? Me? I don't know. I forgot. Wow. Yeah, they just. Shall I take you out bowling this week? Maybe. It's 10. The perfect score being 300 because it's possible to get 30 points in each frame. How many tries does a player get in each frame? One, five, two, or three? Can you imagine if you got five throws in each frame, how much longer it would take to do bowling? <laughs> be a lot easier, though. Yeah. You could really just chuck it. Getting a strike would be such a relief because you could just go sit down. Do you right. the dog dish? Sorry. Whoa, buddy, whoa. Three in Skittles. <laughs> whoa! Sorry. I, I was moving down. I, I bopped him on the face. Oh, I'm so sorry. I was so moving down sorry. from panic to right of the bank. Oh. It's okay. No surprise. Real excited. And, yeah, I ran right into me. It's okay. Okay. Everyone's fine. The passage mostly tells about the rules of the game and what you need to play. The history of bowling. The person who invented bowling or famous players. Oh yeah, so this was definitely... Yeah, this was, this was made for some kind of classroom. Yeah. The Passage. And if they get all knocked down before the third throw, they set them up again. In Skittles. Okay. That's interesting. That must be some, some local thing it shows me, because I've never heard about that. Which statement is true? Only people in the United States bowl. People from many countries like to bowl. Mexico is the only country that has bowling alleys. Only men and boys can bowl. Big, big fan of the green one, though. Yeah. Like, only yes. men and boys. Only can, by the way. Like, yeah. like others are prevented. Yeah. Right. A female tries to bowl, someone will stop them. <laughs> Physically prevent it from happening. The cops will show up. Right. <laughs> Straight to jail. If you do not own a bowling ball or bowling shoes, what can you do? I, I can not, not bowl, I guess. <laughs> rent them at a low cost. Pay a lot of money to rent the items. Give up and go home. Or save your money to buy these There's items. There's two correct answers here. There's three correct answers here. Sure. <laughs> I, wait, no, yeah. all of these are correct. Yeah, yeah, yeah they are. I'm a... I'm a huge fan of the nihilism of give up and go home. Yeah, like, like you, as if you go to bowl, I'm gonna like, well, you need bowling shoes, and you're like, well, I guess yeah. I'm fucked. Oh I, damn, it. damn it! Nobody told me. They're already <laughs> holding up like the bowling shoes. Right? Yeah, like, we have some. <laughs> yeah, I know you have some, but I need right. some. <laughs> oh my god. What? Why do you think special bowling shoes are needed so the bowling alley can make more money? For safety, balance, and to protect the floor, so you can look really cool, or so you can look professional. You gotta understand. You gotta make these kids understand. <laughs> you gotta they're understand. Wearing. You gotta understand. <laughs> yeah, the red for sure, so they can make more money. But you can rent them at a low cost. <laughs> <laughs> or you could just go home. <laughs> you just give up and go home. Wow, that was good. We we did really good at that one, you guys. We're so good at bowling. Oh my gosh, we are. We're ready to go bowling. We're ready to go bowling. I think that was the point of the quiz. Oh boy, okay. What do you want to do? My head hurts and I don't want to go sit on the couch. <laughs> okay, let's do one more. I think a bowling alley made that quiz. You think big bowling is behind this? Big bowling. <laughs> bowling bowl? Cop rock. 
No. <laughs> no, there's no. No, you be. come up with one. <laughs> She's not coming up with anything. I'm just I'm just suggesting things. Um. Hey, buddy. Ooh. Ooh. Yeah, we did. Yeah. 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 Um. Hello. Apples. Bowling. About so like one one or two like roll over when you when you do a new search because this one's bowling does it have elephant in it no no <laughs> why is that one here like get out Ooh, elephant toothpaste. what it's a fun little experiment you can do go ahead and take a look yay what do you achieve well, you make toothpaste that looks like an elephant. Well, like the trunk, I guess. Oh, Alexico Graphic Dream, spin the wheel. Okay, hold on. Let's let's do that. Shosni asks, "Are there cahoots about cahoots?" Oh, I there definitely are. Yes. I don't know if we're ready for that. Okay, here we. Oh wait, hold on. Stop. Hey, let's see in the chat. All right, Lexi just won a fabulous prize by redeeming five thousand Duke dollars. What prize is she gonna get? Alignment An alignment chart. chart. Ooh, this alignment is good. Alignment chart of all the coots we played today. Okay. Uh, yeah, we can do that. I'm for different bowling. <laughs> Which one was the most evil, do you think? Hold on. No discussion yet, we haven't done it. We're not there yet. Hold on. Do that. I'm gonna do this and it'll... Nope. Okay, uh... I have to manually switch it. <laughs> Okay, there we go. Alignment chart of bowling. Okay. Uh, okay, na name one that we did. Power Rangers. Power Rangers. All lowercase for every one of these. Yeah. In the spirit of Uh The Power Rangers was, I think... Do you think it was good? Yeah, it was good because yeah. it was all about beating the bad guys. Yep. And then, yeah. well, and then after names when they ran out of questions. Yeah. I'd say the neutral evil one is the games that we did. Games. Where it yeah. was only male uh, characters allowed. Yep. Yeah. And it was only yeah, it was only big beefy men within games about war. Yeah, that was it. Um. Let's see. Mm -hmm. Almost, almost lawful evil for that one. What, what did we do? We did bowling. Bowling, bowling I think, is lawful neutral. It was just yeah. about the laws it of bowling. It was about the laws <laughs> of bowling. Uh, elephant? No, no, we haven't done an elephant. Um, so we did one about atoms. At yes, the the atomic. Uh, that one is true. Theory. Neutral. It was pure fact, and it was very dry. Yeah, that one was. That one was pretty scientific. Oh, um, we oh, did we did a bridge. we did a Hades quiz. That's right, oh, Hades, yeah. the game. That one was was a lot of true falses. Yeah, I think I think that's lawful evil then, because a lot of a lot of true false. Uh, but it did end with is the dog good? Yeah, true. Like that, good dog, bad it's, dog. It's like getting. It, it, I you could make it. I think that's evil. I think that's there. evil. Um, got yeah, sexy. sexy. Uh, what else do we do? The we actually did a God of War quiz. Yep. Uh, it was it was very short, and it was like not good. Um, How about the Disney one we did? Yeah, we did do. I Disney. really didn't like the, the kiss one. Oh yeah, yeah. Okay. Well then, that's uh, that's the Disney one was. I'm gonna say it's evil. Yeah. Okay. Disney one was chaotic evil. Yeah. It's just spreading falsehoods about princesses. It did say all princesses. Every single princess. It did use that phrase. Um, mm -hmm. 
Well, requires true love kiss. I mean, I guess technically Merida wasn't a princess anymore. She was the queen at that point because they assumed the mom was dead because she was a bear. I guess technically she wasn't a princess. No, we're not. We're not letting them off the hook. Did it have that long we? I, I know it. I don't think it did. Oh yeah, Colbridge's quiz. Um, I think mine should be lawful evil. I no. I think it was um, lawful good because yeah. it was purely written, very well written. It's just yeah, it was about history. It taught us a lot of interesting facts. Um, what else did we do? Hmm. Why can't I remember now? <laughs> Hold on, I'm gonna I'm gonna like go through our vod. Yep. Real quick, keep thinking. Is that something you can do midstream? Mm -hmm. Yes. Yep. Oh, cool. I didn't know that. Yeah. Yeah, they make the VOD in, like, real time. Uh, there we go. Curb. We did curb. We did curb. Curb. We did one about chaotic good. Curb. Oh, yes. Oh. The... Curb. Curb. Chaotic good. Kirby. Okay. Maybe that's chaotic neutral, though. I don't know. We did do a God of War no. one. We did like a really short God of War one. Hold on, where what what else do we do about this? Uh, <laughs> I was the finale. How is that not chaotic? I I didn't say it was not chaotic. I said it was maybe not good. Oh, excuse me. <laughs> We're not categorizing a curb a kahoot as not good. That was that's that's the Colbridge one. The Adams, Adams, Disney. I think we have to keep. Uh, I think we played exactly nine cahoots. So wow. Far. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Then we'll then we'll say God of War was the chaotic neutral. Her, her <laughs> God of water. water. It's very, like Shape of Water, but different. Very, very different. <laughs> Curb chaotic good. Okay. Here we go. Which I don't remember making, this is Gulfridge, really? Oh, goodness. Okay. Hold on. Blackout for just a second. Wait, there's another redhead quiz Gulfridge made that we haven't done yet? There's, like, yeah, there's so many of them. Nice. He, he, he remember? He was like, oh, yeah, I'll, I'll like, make a, um, a thing so that we can play. And then he was like, oh, by the way, I made, like, 12 of them. Here oh they all God. are. Oh, my God. That's amazing. Why does this not show... Because it's broken, that's why. I don't know why. You are welcome, Alex. Anytime. It's just broken. Okay. All right. Last last one, which is about elephants, as Sriracha requested. Um. Nope. That one's just too real. Right. Hold on, there we go, that's lowercase. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I think, I think this one's good. You gotta scroll down for the real good. I, th I think this one will stay normal, like, be normal and then go off the rails. That's our goal. How oh, nice, silly newt. These pins being seven numbers is so many numbers. <laughs> Champion owl. Champion. Ooh. Thank you for the prize. I'm glad you enjoyed, Alex. That's a that's a good one for you too, because I know you love uh, um, strange organizations of information. What? <laughs> is that not true? Uh, it could have been put more delicately. More delicately. Or or or, or more formally. All right, get get in here, everybody. Kahoot.it. <laughs> I'm a strange organization of information. That's the damn truth. I don't want to hang out with people who aren't. You silly neat. Oh, has it been playing this music every time? You have to mute it every single time? 
Maybe it has been, and we just couldn't hear it over the music we were already playing. That got it. Okay. I mean, I think Purple Ferret has an advantage, you know, being the globe. That's true. That's a lot of information. Silly, silly mute. Because I muted the volume. Okay, here we go. I'm going to need my phone for this. Elephant. Just the one. That's all there's left? Wow. <laughs> Brutal. The term elephant comes from a Greek word meaning long nose, land giant, big tooth, or tooth. Just tooth. Just tooth. Nobody got it. Felt matter to the Greeks. Yeah. Oh, you see one of those guys? Oh, you mean the tooth? <laughs> How high can an elephant jump? 21 feet. Never. Two feet or your mom's height. How do they know? I'm intrigued, but like, there's a story in here of an elephant dunking somewhere. <laughs> Elephants can't jump. Never. Can an elephant jump higher than a house? I mean, like, logically that makes sense, because jumping elephants would be horrifying. But I also do want them to have a little baby <laughs> jump. <laughs> Which of the three species of, el of elephant is endangered? African, bush, <laughs> Asian, or forest? Is it not all of the types of elephants? None of the impression elephants were just endangered as an animal. Oh, it's, it's Asian elephants, apparently. Really? Yeah. Oh, just, Maybe just... African elephants are really threatened. Maybe. African. <laughs> they will be in a second. <laughs> For how many years have elephants been used as working animals throughout Asia? 1,987, 666, or 5,000. It's amazing that you were able to track it down. Right, <laughs> to, to the, that specific a degree. Uh -huh. African. Yeah, we found, we found a, a primary source that said, at exactly this time, we started using elephants as working animals. 987 is so specific. From, from this day forward. It's not even like 985, which would just be a Germa reference. Mm hmm. How long can a elephant live? Beautiful. 100, 48, <laughs> 70, 86. So specific. Yeah, this is in thousands of hours, so oh, and then no. you gotta do the math. Uh. I love how many pictures of baby elephants. Why are there two? 70 Why and 86 yeah, were they correct. Can either one. I guess maybe. But nothing in between. 70 is the average. 86 is like the oldest known. I don't know. Sure. Yeah, they live to 70 or 86. No, nothing else. <laughs> Is it okay for visitors to ride trained Asian elephants? False or true? I'm going to vote for the one I think. I'm pretty upset that they didn't write true or false. It's not true? It's not okay. It's not okay to ride elephants. They're not, they're not designed for that. Wow. They've been used as working animals in Asia for 987 years, Soraya. <laughs> Doesn't make it okay. <laughs> How much can elephants weigh? 69 tons, 69 pounds, 300 tons, or 13,000 pounds. How much is a ton? 2,000 pounds? Yeah. yeah. That's like so many. Okay, yeah. The 300 tons is so much weight. <laughs> Confusing units, yeah. says Jesney. The units <laughs> curveball. <laughs> So rarely do I ever have to think about how much a ton is. Where how tall is? is a elephant? Feet. 12, 9, 69, or 11. No, it depends on the elephant. And the kind of elephant. And 11, 9, 11, and 12 are so close together. Ah, uh -huh, and the correct answer was 9, 11. <laughs> okay. Double points. Who should you donate to? WWF neeps.godaddysites.com Team Trees are I'll never donate. Oh no! It's it's GoDaddy Sites. I mean that was the only. Alex, like, I need you to do it. Open the new tab. No. I, I'm doing it. No, we can't. I'm opening incognito tab. You're absolutely gonna get a virus from that. 
Oh, no. Thousand percent. Dot go daddy. No, 404. Nope. Okay. <laughs> no, that makes, it, that makes it available. It's available. <laughs> Why on earth wouldn't you use stones? Yeah, guys, in about 10 minutes, go to neeps.godaddysites.com to see Redhead Orama's official website, apparently. I wonder <laughs> if Neeps made this quiz. All right, question 10. When will elephants go extinct if we don't help? 2069, 2021, 2025, <laughs> or 2036? <laughs> when, when this was written. Yeah. Dang it, I picked 2021. Crap, only have two years. Okay, 11. True or false? An a elephant herd is male and female. Wait, does it mean it's made up of males and females? That's what I'm assuming. Because it's not. Oh, it's not? <laughs> well, why Damn are you going to say Sariah. that? You couldn't have waited until after I answered? No, yeah, because the dudes, the they go off and itself. do whatever, and the ladies, they all they hang out. They take care of the children? Yeah. I didn't know that. Yeah. Wow. Why do you know so much about elephants? What's the reason they picked elephants? We watched a video about elephants recently. Double points, here we go. The term <laughs> elephant means tooth, long See, nose, land giant, or this earth is good. shaker. We review the question and be like Yeah, Glow is right, there's male yeah. and female in the children. It was a bad question. I'm not gonna argue with that. <laughs> but the I feel like bad. This is <laughs> not <laughs> Yes, the herd is non binary. I feel like this is not the question we needed to review, though. Maybe the, like, extinction ones were more important information to go back over? Tooth! Oh, nope, tooth. <laughs> tooth! Nice job, bronze raccoon. Thank you, I'm very good at elephants. I'm very good at elephants. Oh, I wish I had cut your clothes. Okay, I have to go tend to my sick wife. So I'm sorry, it's a short viewer game stream today. Children don't count. They can't be trusted with gender. That's true. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Let's go raid uh, Affinity Chris playing some Witcher 3. Which is a game that has magic and swords and sometimes pretty ladies in it. Um. Oh, hi, Eleven. How are you doing? Good to see you. Sorry, Sorry you made it in. Sorry, has low energy today because she's getting sick. Because I infected her. I tried not to get infected by him, but he's infectious. I am. I didn't try that hard. I forgot about the pirate section. <laughs> yeah, I. Or like the the rena the weird like Renaissance poofy clothes section of the game. Yeah. Did you play Witcher Three? No. He's going right up to the statue is and there looking. A penis? Okay. Yeah. No, there wasn't. Well, there was just like a hole. It's an implied penis. Oh. Okay. To each his own. All right. <laughs> Be warned. We're raiding a mature stream. Be warned. Implied penis ahead. <laughs> okay. Uh. Penis is non-gendered. We will be back tomorrow with uh, a game or games of Sriracha's choice. I want to play roguelikes. I want to play roguelikes. And, uh, yeah. So I hope to see you all there. Thank you to all of our new follows and, and uh, to everybody who played with us. And, uh, like Rogue? Maybe. Who knows? Maybe we'll play it. We don't own Rogue. <laughs> Bye, everybody. Oh, yes, you do. What? It's, it's 